Kia ora, welcome to my happy place. If you like today's video, please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment so I know that you've been, don't be shy, and please enjoy. Kia ora, welcome to Waste Some Time with Maggie. I've come on to have a more play in my um, journal I'm using. I've made some alterations. My one inch vine was not big enough and so I made a bigger spine and it's about one and a half just after, over one and a half I think measure it. it might be nearer two. Oh no yeah just over one and a half because it was very gator mouth so I'm very happy with that and I didn't do it online because I have never done it before. I just cut the spine down the middle and then I just cut it off completely and cut some extra um, couple of layers. Well, a nice heavy box, but that still wasn't thick enough. So then I put a layer of um, cereal box over it and then I put tape on it to hold it together and then I put this um, linen, pink linen that I had wasn't wide enough so I had to double it up and I did that on both sides and then I stitched it in with um, jute because that's all I had and one was slightly higher than the other. The, the you can't really notice it on the on the box, but on the signatures. But it was slightly higher. You could notice it on the back, and I didn't like the look of it on the back. So then I put this lace on either either side. How wide is it? Hmm, I thought I had a bit here somewhere. Anyway put this stuff whatever it's called on it and then to cover that up I put that lace up the middle and I'm really happy with it in fact I'm quite stoked about it so that is now a much better size for my two signatures that are starting to get very fat and a little bit of decorating some tags so I've done that and so I thought that I just might do that a little bit of put a little bit of um, bits and pieces into the journal and decorate a few things right so this one here put a little bit of lace on it or something like that now, where are all my new bits and pieces that I cut? I'm sure I've got them all here. Let me just move that out of the road and we will find some bits. We have got tags. Mm. Bit of move where you can see me. Right. That's another wave. This is an envelope that I've um, just lined. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but we have lots of these sort of things. That so we'll be able to put lots of these in. We've got words and oh, this is what I did um, because I had so many of the. Um, journaling cards printed out I'd got doubles and so I put the, the photos or the pictures on the top of them to give them a little bit of a frame so I did that to a few of the little ones as well just to make them more solid so I've got that I've got a few that we haven't used so we'll put all those little bits up here Right, we've got those and we've got these, all these little bits and pieces here. 
that we can put in as well because they go with the all go with the kit so we're just going to go through and put some little bits on and she go might go nice just like that well, like that so this is what I'm going to do and we're all set nicely that all our appointments were over and done with while my daughter is in Australia because my other daughter works full time and my granddaughter works full time so we thought no that's okay everything's set unless there was something emergency but um, I have been waiting for knee surgery it's minor compared to I'm not having a replacement or anything like that pretty minor but when you're 75 they don't consider any surgery minor but it's just day surgery for most people but I don't do well with um, that looks nice I don't do well with um, um, anesthetics or or um, pain medications so um, I have to stay in overnight and my husband can't drive me so that means I have to have a driver so I have to be there at seven o'clock in the morning which is quite um, quite good really because um, my young my granddaughter starts early but my daughter starts at eight o'clock or eight thirty and I have to be there by seven so she'll have enough time to um, I think I'm going to put that down there I might just smush a little bit of lace under it so she's going to take me over and drop me off and my husband will have to come and stay at the hospital just he'll just you know find a chair and read a book or something because they don't want me leaving him, him at home on his own and if anything happened well he'll be in the hospital so, so that's good so she's going to drop me off and then my granddaughter is going to come after after work because she knocks off early uh, four around about three four so she will um, come over and pick my husband up and settle him for the night between them and um, then um, I will just have to stay at the hospital until the afternoon for one of the girls to come and pick me up because one of them would have taken Thursday off but um, they're short staffed so that wasn't going to happen so I think that just that there is good but we have a, have a little bit more glue on it I think I forgot to, I put plug mix glue gun in but forgot to turn it on right I like that all right That's something a little bit bigger here that we can mm. let me see that's nice and this here is the same picture that is on one of the pockets that I use from a different kit as well so they both all work out pretty nicely together could have a little bit of lace down the edge of this like that so I'm not 
worried about the surgery in any way, but I'm not looking forward to the anaesthetic. The last time I had anaesthetic, I was violently ill for 48 hours afterwards. So, what I'm going to be like is anybody's guess. And they say that, you know, I will need some pain medication. And I don't do pain medication either. Right. That looks nice. I like that. So, it's going to be very interesting. I wonder if you can call it that. Right, now, here's my bit overhead. Like that there, like that. Put a little tab of lace on it. Quite like that. I'll put some glue down on this. So other than that, nothing much has been happening. Hubby still isn't particularly well, so I said to him is he going to be able to handle sitting at the hospital all day, but he thinks he'll be okay. Right, I'll just put that about there, I think. Nice. Oh, just it needs to be glued down there, but oh yes, I think that's hot enough to just to put a little dab there. That's all we need. Nice. I like that. Yes, so it's going to be very interesting. I think we'll take that one out and put one of these ones in that I've already covered. And we'll have something like this here. Like that. Or maybe this one here. That's nice. I like that. Yes, yeah, so I thought I'd come on and do a video tonight. Tomorrow I have to go and do shopping. Put some food in because we might not have our car for the weekend and I might not be able to drive for a little bit. Right, like that. Now, where are those words? I might put a word in there. Special happiness. Would happiness fit in there? Yes, if I trim it. Trim it a bit. And, and that can go in there like that. Alright, what did I do with it? Okay, what did I do with it? I don't know how you can lose things on your desk. It really amazes me. Right, move that into reasonably straight for me. Okay. Right, so this one here, I thought we'd just put a little bit of lace. as a topper on it. What about that? Quite nice. I think the, this will hold this down, I think. Pretty sure. Now, which way does it go? That way. Right, I'll put that be like that. Let's get a cloth to dab up the glue. It dries clear, but nice. And it doesn't take long to dry. We don't want our pages sticking together. Oh, we need something to go up here. Yeah. One of these.
open it, it looks nice. I wonder if I need to glue that down. I'd glued this bit to the paper and so I couldn't get it off, so it just had to stay there and a bit down this end. <laughs> right. This is a pretty tight. I'll save that one for the for the next. Nice. That'll fit in there. That's been journaled on. We don't have to do anything to it, I don't think. Nice. And Time piece there, it's, it's nice, it's cute. Right, slip that there like that, and a little postcard alongside. Yeah. Why not? Yes, I was very, very disappointed when I looked at my journal and that the spine was this big and the mouth was that big. I thought, oh no, that's no good. I haven't even finished putting things in it yet. And we have it's just a little little bit of paper this one just printed on paper so I'm just going to put that down there just a little bit of something different no. Decided if I'm going to do anything yet. Now I was going to look for something. Right. I'm back. I found them. I've um, aged some paper clips with um, Tim Holtz alcohol inks because I can't buy peroxide to rust them. So I thought we'd just um, put a <coughs> Excuse me. Put a little um, tag on there. Look at this one. Look at this one. Um, yes, can't get peroxide at the moment, so I did them with alcohol inks and they, they worked out quite well. I was quite pleased with those. Right, a little rose, rose or two. No, that's quite big, isn't it? I have a single one. Let me see what have I got. Just a little single one. That's that's what we want. Right. That's already got something on it. This one here. That looks nice. Maybe just a little bit of lace with it, like that. Oops. Got the shakes again. Right. 
Not for the right pin. No, it doesn't need anything. Alright. What have we got in here? I don't know if this needs anything as such. No. Oh, it could go over there, though. It could go over there. And I still haven't inked any of my big staples, but never mind. Like that. And we'll just put something over here to cover our Like that. like that, I think. Yeah, to um, colour any of my big ones. And I looked on um, the big craft shop that we have in Auckland to see if I could buy a um, Tim Holtz Tiny Attacher. But no, they're out of stock. Alright, that's okay. This one has just got that on. I think we'll just leave that like that. I changed up my mind. I think I might just put a little bit of stamping on the page and here and there just just to break up the thing. Don't do that. Just to break up the, and I don't want it all, just little bits. Yep, that will be good enough. I like that. Right. Now, what was in there? Just one of these, I think. Just one of these. And it could have just a little, little bit of something that can staple it into it like that. Like that. Yes. It just breaks up the, don't worry about that side. Right, now. What have we got in the way of something for a pocket? I want to put the pocket on that side. Or on this side, maybe. I think on this side. Just a little. Just a little pocket. Just like that. A little postcard here. Go in there. And we've got something in there. I like that page. It came out really nice. Right now, this is where this where, where that came from, and I've got another little um, checklist here, and I had a little bit of lace there, and I thought I'd just put a little bit of lace across the top of it like that. And if I had a thought about it, I would have sewn it on, but I've only got black cotton in there, and I don't think it needs black cotton with it. And I 
can't go changing my cotton every day of the week because I cannot see to thread the needle and I have to get my sister to do it. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Right. And then just clip that to the side. Like so. Like that. Like that. And that's too big. Yeah, so a little clock and moments like that. Butterfly, a little bit of, a little bit of lace under them, maybe. Yeah. Do we need it that big? Maybe not. Just a little bit shorter. Get on there. Hold a bit of lace down. All right. Down for a moment. Yep, I don't mind the wings when you not being down. It's quite cool. Mm, I'm not quite sure what to do here. Be a belly band. I have to think about that page. Alright, I've got another pocket here. Bird's cage here. Pieces going everywhere. All right. All right. Maybe there's something on this side, like, like that. I like that. Like that, and we'll just put that down as a little tuck. Like that. And like that. Get our little bird cage. And then put that down. Yeah. Yeah. Get tag. Hmm. That's a bit silly that. Should have left that a little bit. Let me see. Right, yeah. That will go in there. Needed a little bit of not putting too close to the to the um, glue while it's drying, mind you. That glitter glue doesn't take long to long to um, to dry. What 
Oh, so we go here. a bit of something on the page what I'm going to put in it later. I think I might have another one of those and some little, uh, whoops, some little uh, receipt things here somewhere. on that side. This, this is pretty. Maybe that. Maybe that. Let's go around, go back around and go around these um, little labels I'm putting down because they haven't got anything on them. I can do that later. nothing on it. And another tag here that's already decorated so we'll put that in there. Mm. Let's get in there. Got to get it in the right place. That's nice. And we can slip a tag in there, I think. For now, anyway. And you slip here and there like that. That will hold. Nice. I need this one, I think. And we can slip that over like that. Make sure it's even. I'm not great at making things even. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah, that's good enough. And that is good enough. Let's 
most probably because I didn't cut it right. That's okay. Right. And that can go down in there like that. Like that. And it can have a tiny little butterfly on it. Just because I can. Hmm. Alright. So thank you for being with me. I'm so pleased with that. Thank you for being with me. Kia kaha, stay strong, and I'll catch you again soon.